And stay tuned. We're going to get back to more action here at the Superstars of Wrestling in just a moment or two. I want to bring forth this gentleman. He has been a legend in professional wrestling for quite some time. One of the greats from Algiers, Algeria, ladies and gentlemen. I want to introduce to you, and when they made this one, they threw the mold away. Only one like him. He is, fans, Mad Dog Vishon. Mad Dog, I've got to say this to you. Welcome to the World Wrestling Federation. Finally, the big leagues deserving talent like yours. You know, mister, I see a lot of announcers like you to tap me on the shoulder, but when I turn around, they stab me in the back. I want to make it perfectly clear to all of you concerned out there watching the television that the mad dog has no friends. I don't want any friends because they're the one to stab you in the back. A lot of people ask themselves, why is a human being like you and become the mad dog? I wasn't brought up between two silk sheets and wear a tuxedo. I was brought up in a big family of 13 children. And a lot of nights I had to go to bed without nothing in the stomach. And what I did eat, I had a lot of time digging out of a garbage can. Yes. And I wanted to be fair and square in wrestling. All tell the beat up on me, broke my teeth. Not, not really out of a, gar not literally out of a garbage can. Have you ever been hungry? Have you ever gone to bed hungry, mister? I don't drive Cadillac cars, but I know one thing. When I go in the ring, it's doggy dog. And I don't take no prisoner, my friend. <sighs> I thank you. He has arrived to the World Wrestling Federation, the Mad Dog Vishon. 